Um, all right. I'm going to spend like three minutes talking about teachers. Okay? <laughs> and don't get me wrong. Like, I am uh, a believer in college and education if it is right for you. But with that, um, I will say that schools are always going to be behind the curve. Even if the teacher's out there working, he's or she is actually forced to teach a certain way because the software, the grading, the books, the materials that they're fed can't keep up. Um, and all of this shit you can learn yourself. Uh, it's really kind of about the drive and about whether you can be creative enough to come up with a project yourself, right? Uh, that's going to challenge you and teach you. So. I don't hold it against the teacher at all <clears throat> for telling you, hey, it's got to start with doc time. She or he was right way back in the day. But if they're telling you that today, that is just simply untrue and they are very far behind the curve, right? So um, there are a few schools that do a really good job of keeping up with this stuff and their faculty gets out of their way as far as letting them teach. But most schools, especially like regular colleges, just don't keep up and you graduate a couple to two to four years behind the curve and you're not able to actually be relevant in the job market because you're so fucking far behind right um, and that was like really the advantage I had was by not going to college was just get out there catch up learn everything and go you know? so um, Anybody that tells you to get a job in engineering or software, like, that you have to go to college is full of shit. Like, you can absolutely learn all this shit yourself. And you can go into the workforce with, like, none of the fucking debt associated with being behind in technology. So, alright. I'm done with my rant. <laughs> that is my position on school. <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> I am. I'm all done. <laughs> But because of HTML5,